Hey y'all, welcome to my channel. Um, sorry about the background, super boring. We're usually gonna be in the living room, but I just wanted to make sure I could get a video out for you guys today. I procrastinated. So we're gonna do it right here at my desk and let's get into it. So for today's video, obviously you can see from the title, we're gonna be talking all about films that are centered on, around, or in the Appalachian Mountains or on or about Appalachian folklore. So let me crack out my list here and let's get right on into the video. So if you guys see me look down, it's it's just my list. Starting off this list very strong with one of my personal favorites, the 2020 film Spell. Spell is a horror thriller that follows a man whose plane crashes in rural Appalachia where he is rescued by a woman who practices hoodoo. This film gives major misery vibes. If you like misery, you'll definitely like this film and it is currently streaming on Paramount Plus, I think. Next up we have Wrong Turn. Really any of the wrong turns are centered in Appalachia, but I'm specifically talking about the 2021 Wrong Turn. Like the remake, but not really a remake. This horror thriller follows a group of friends who are hiking the Appalachian Trail that run into a community of people that have been there for hundreds of years. And this one is streaming on Showtime. I think the other Wrong Turns might be on there as well, but I'm not positive. What's y'all's favorite wrong turn? Cause I, I don't know. I don't know what mine is. Next up we have the 2005 film, The Descent. This horror thriller follows a cave expedition in North Carolina gone so wrong, so wrong. If you are claustrophobic, this is probably not the movie for you. If you get triggered watching it, if you've seen As Above, So Below and you were like, whoa, don't watch this. Um, I think the second one is also based in the same area. I've never seen the second one, but um, The Descent is very good. I vouch for it every time, but again, if you're claustrophobic, maybe think about it. And that one was on Netflix, but I'm pretty sure it's only to rent now. It may be on Tubi, but I don't think so. This next one, you cannot have an Appalachia horror movie list without mentioning the 2002 film Mothman Prophecies. The Mothman Prophecies follows a reporter who is investigating a small town in West Virginia where strange things keep happening. And this is of course based on the Mothman of Point Pleasant, West Virginia. I don't think this one's streaming anywhere. I think it's just available to rent. Also, I'm sorry I keep like slinging my pen into frame. I'm like, <laughs> I put the original, but also the remake would work as well. But I am talking about the 1981 film, The Evil Dead. I'm sure you've seen this and you've definitely seen the um, remake, but it follows a friend group who gets a cabin to help their friend detox and they summon a demon that possesses and makes you do really bad things. Like really, really bad things. Think the sadness type things. This one is available on Amazon Prime, I believe. I think the remake is available on a few more things, maybe even Tubi. I like the remake a lot better to be honest. The remake terrorized me as a kid. That's one of the scariest movies I've ever seen in my life. We're on page two. Okay, before I say the next one, disclaimer. I am fully aware that this movie does not take place in even America, but it is based on Appalachian folklore. And if we go back to like the Pangea talk where they were once connected, this was, this is technically the Appalachian Mountains, okay? So just, anyways. This film is, of course, the 2017 film, The Ritual. Now, The Ritual follows a group of friends hiking the Sweden mountains when they encounter a super terrifying being. I will recommend this movie every time I can, and it is on Netflix. Next, we have the 2021 movie, The Devil Below. This horror thriller follows a team investigating an abandoned town in Appalachia and it is available on Netflix as well. Next up, we have one of my absolute personal favorites, and that is the 1999 movie, The Blair Witch Project. This horror mystery follows a group of friends who are exploring local woods to try and find a legend and find more than they bargained for. When this film came out in 1999, there was actually a fake website launched. Um, people already thought it was kind of real because no one had really seen the found footage stuff yet. And um, this fake website made it even more real. People thought the Blair Witch was real. These people were really missing. It caused quite a stir. And the movie did really well based off of that stuff. Like, because that happened, it created a lot of, you know, talk. So this movie is not true, but it is loosely based off of the Bell Witch of Tennessee, which I will also be doing a video on TikTok soon of her. You can stream the original Blair Witch Project on Pluto and Tubi completely for free. 
This next one is one of my favorite Appalachia based horror movies and I never see anyone talk about it. So let's get into it. This is the 2013 horror drama Jug Face. Jug Face follows a community deep in Appalachia who has to give a special sacrifice to a reservoir every so often. And it's, it's a lot, it's a lot. Um, highly recommend it if you like Appalachia stuff. You will love this movie. You will love it. And it's completely for free on Tubi, so you got nothing to lose but like an hour and a half. I don't want to recommend the next one, but I'm going to because it follows the folklore. Um, this film technically takes place in, I think it's either Washington State or Oregon, but it's the same type of folklore. I'm just going to plug it. A lot of people like it. I hated it, but it's fun. I am talking about the 2021 film Antlers. That's all I'm going to say about it. It's fine. It's fine. It's not fine. That movie let me down so bad. Next up, we have the film Alien Abduction. Alien Abduction is actually loosely based on the Brown Mountain Lights of North Carolina, which I've done a video recently on TikTok on if you're interested. Um, I kind of want to do a big video on here as well, compiling like um, Appalachian legends, but it's really interesting if you guys like that. It is available to rent not streaming anywhere but it is very good i highly recommend it also here on youtube completely for free there is a comedy horror short titled they are here by cryptid pictures if you guys want to check that out it's also based on the brown mountain lights it's really good it's really funny and their depictions of the creatures are really cool and they're making that into a series if you like it so that's awesome and that'll be here next year i think hopefully they're great um they also <sighs> I don't know how much I'm allowed to say because the production, okay. Um, the same people that did They Are Here actually did, you know what? I'm gonna cut that because I don't know if I'm, I don't know how much I'm allowed to say. And that is all my movies. Thank you guys so much for being here, being patient with me getting this channel going. I hope we can grow and talk about a thousand things. I wanna talk scary movies, scary stories, Appalachian stories. I wanna do all the things. So give me a thumbs up if you liked it. Subscribe if you want to see more and you can turn on my little bell. Maybe, maybe YouTube will notify you. I honestly don't know. But thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you again next week. Bye.